The Zydeco Music Festival is this weekend, and Miss Lena Charles is joining us today to talk about all the fun things that we can expect at this weekend's event. Miss Lena, thanks for joining us today. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. Now, this is the 40th annual Southwest, right. Southwest Louisiana Zydeco Music Festival. It's a big year for you guys. Yes, it is. And so I definitely want to touch a little bit on the history yes. and how this Zydeco Festival came to be. Yes. I'm always excited to talk about it because I'm, I'm humbled to think that we're here 40 years and that we continuously have been the tellers of the uh, stories and the keepers of the culture. But 40 years ago, the Treasures of Opelousas, which was a committee for the Holy Ghost Catholic Church under the leadership of their pastor, Father A.J. McKnight, said, how could we preserve the Creole culture to be a passed on to the next generation? And they came up with having a festival, and uh, Clifton Chenier was the king, and he was talking about the snap beans, and the uh, father had a relationship with Southern Development Foundation. So they said, well, where are we going to hold it? It was a bean field. The word Zydeco came about, and 40 years later, we're still celebrating the original Southwest Louisiana Zydeco Music Festival. There's so many things that it evolved you know, to not only saturate the area, but the United States, and it's international now. How do you celebrate the culture of a people? How do you closely tie them to a land? Through the Zydeco music, and it is contagious. And no better way to celebrate our culture than with this music festival. Of course, there's food and dancing involved, too. But we can't do any of this without these sponsors. Who are some of the amazing organizations sponsoring this event? Yes. Well, we have a big sponsor with Evangeline Downs, Racetrack and Casino. That's the Friday night kickoff dance. And then we have St. Landry Parish Tourism, Opelousas Tourism, and, of course, the state of Louisiana. And our big one is LCVC, Lafayette Visitors and Convention. You know, culture doesn't stop at the uh, city line. This is Southwest Louisiana. So everybody comes in as well as St. Landry Parish government to make this a community festival. Absolutely. And everything is kicking off Friday night at 9 p.m. with the kickoff dance. And then Saturday, what kind of music can we look forward to on Saturday? At 12 o'clock from 12 to 12, Chubby Carrier. Then uh, French, with, you know, we have French Rock and Boogie. Mm -hmm. And then we have Corey Ledette. So at the Gino, we got some young guns in there. And then we have Mike Broussard, uh, Jeremy Fruget, and we're closing out with Rusty Matoir and Zydeco Cruz. We have a parade that'll come down the main highway, Landry Street. Stop at the courthouse with Jeffrey Broussard with the Zydeco Breakfast, sponsored by the city. So we just have a fun day. Absolutely. A fun, fun day on Saturday. Again, that kickoff dance is going to be on Friday night at 9 p.m. Then all day Saturday, head over to Opelousas for some great music. Visit Zydeco.org to learn more.